Warning, this video may make you doubt the way you work with code and make you even smarter. Viewer discretion is strongly advised. Meet Joseph, or Jane, or Joe. Pretty much your regular software developer. Joe can program a coffee machine to brew a hot one, especially when he's hungover, but still has nightmares about not getting an LGTM on a pull request. But that's until he launches Block and discovers the wonders of the GitHub universe. After that, it's pretty much Joe coding his way into stardom. He uses Flock to do these four key things on GitHub. Joe needs to check on personal notifications. And no, he doesn't need to have a GitHub tab open all the time. Anytime anyone mentions Joe on GitHub, he gets a ping on Flock, including when there's an update to pull requests and issues he's a part of. But will Joe be able to send notifications from GitHub to any channel he wants? Flock's been there, done that. And now for Joe's extraordinary power number two. With Flock, he can search or browse literally all his repositories in the sidebar. Or jump directly to what he wants to work on by using the slash GitHub command. Now for Joe's third superpower. Joe can actually share rich GitHub content from within Flock. Issues, pull requests, commits, and branches, you name it, we've got it. And here's the part that makes Joe stand apart from the rest, making him the flag bearer of hope for his brothers and sisters toiling nights and days to... Okay, I digress. But here's the thing. He can assign, close, or merge pull requests and issues right within Flock. So, and there's no humble way to say this, now Joe has more time to, uh, you know, save the world and stuff. Your entire GitHub universe, now in Flock.